Yo YouTube, what's poppin'? It's your boy ZVG coming back with a banger video for y'all, man. Hey man, check this out. So Bandai just released the future units, future Gohan, future my future SSJ2 teen trunks and the androids. Alright, so let me tell you straight up right now. Gohan is the best in this banner. If you're summoning summon for Gohan, it's Gohan. My then Chunks. Chunks is ass. Don't you you do not want Chunks, bro. I'm telling you right now, you do not want Chunks. Gohan is the key in this banner, alright? So let me go ahead and show you guys Gohan's stats. His stats aren't really all that too great, but <laughs> it's not his stats you need to worry about, alright? He brings two strike arts cards, has an ultimate and all that shit. His ability, future. 26% base strike, 31% attack future or attack hybrid second strike at 5 stars, ultimate, yeah, all that good. This, <laughs> this is where Gohan gets crazy, yo. Team future strike attack up, you, you don't care about this, okay? The future team is ass. The future team does not have enough buffs to keep up with Saiyans and even hybrids, bro. To be honest with you. And they have too much blast cards in their arsenal. So don't worry about this. He's, he won't be used in a future team. I'm telling you right now. His best team is. If you probably guessed. If you saw the thumbnail of this video. You probably guessed it. Super Saiyans. Alright. So Super Saiyans is his best team. And I'll tell you guys why. So. This right here. This right here is why Gohan is so freaking He's amazing because of this right here. Alright, so the following effects will apply on allies when this character is defeated 30% to strike damage inflicted, 35% to key recovery, and he increased arts card draw speed by one level and plus 15% damage to 50% damage to inflicted by attack future. Now, let me get into it, alright? So, in the SSJ team, you know you're going to have SSJ Bardock and Broly, and you're going to put Gohan in there. Just trust me. You're going to put Gohan in there, right? And you know that people rise and rush every game, all right? So, the key with this team is you want them to rise and rush, but you want them to rise and rush Gohan so that Gohan can die so that he can pass these buffs to Broly, all right? Gohan is... A sacrificial piece in the SSJ team which is fine <laughs> because after he dies <laughs> Broly is gonna eat ass but <laughs> anyways yeah 30% strike damage 35% key recovery and he increased card arts draw so that's that's a like side step right there you know what I'm saying but this is where these buffs get crazy all right so I'm gonna have a clip running and showing you guys why this team will be so freaking busted. So guys, you have to understand that Broly can do infinite combos for 30 timer counts. Do you know how long 30 timer counts is in a PvP match? That's just how busted this unit is, bro. Like, this team is going to be so deadly. And the fact, think about this. 
People are going to rise and rush in a match anyway, right? And you're probably going to die. So why not let Gohan die? And in return, you get to kill all the units with Broly. You know what I'm saying? And even then, not only Broly, SSJ Bardock, he's gonna get 30% strike damage increase and key restore and the sidestep thing too. But his sidestep won't be on par with Broly's. But he'll still get it, you know what I'm saying? So overall, the team is great. So you let Gohan die, boom. Now you have an unstoppable force in Broly. For 30 time accounts, infinite combos, as long as you keep drawing strike arts cards. And it's just like... <laughs> oh my god, this team is going to be so cancer. Plus, Gohan doesn't even have bad stats. He has like pre-transformation Broly type stats. You know, you get what I'm saying? Also, he'll be buffed by Bardock and Super Vegeta on the bench. So he won't be completely useless. He can still do damage, he still has the ultimate and stuff. So, yeah guys, that's it. You can try this team out for yourself. Tell me how well it works for you. Gohan, Bardock, and Broly. Make sure you guys let Gohan die. Sorry my boy Gohan, but that's all you're good for. You need to die so that you can buff all the other units on the team for infinite timer counts, guys. It's infinite timer counts. So... Yeah, try this team. I think this, this, this team is going to be the new Holy Trinity, to be honest. So, tell me what you guys think in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys in the next one. DVG, out.